When you step inside Milano's restaurant in Westlaco, you're looking at where the Milano family grew up. up and we ate in this kitchen. There's Lisa Ramon Milano's grandparents moved to Wasago from Chicago in 1944 along with their children, including Lino Milano. He ended up having a job with the United States Post Office delivering mail in Wasago. He knew everybody's address and everybody's name. The family was looking to profit in the citrus industry, but when that froze up, they turned to their Italian roots to find success. Well, they sold pizza out of the house, and it was just a little house that we opened up a little section and started serving to the public. Lino is Lisa's father and the man most people in Hidalgo County know as the friendly, hardworking man who owned and operated Milano's Restaurant, an Italian eatery with touches of the old country and the original kitchen where Mr. Milano cooked up his family's meals and served up love for his community. My father um, would go around and greet all the people uh, in the restaurant and make sure that their dining experience was the best that they could have. Probably in the past year or two, he hadn't really been able to um, get around to the tables, but he still sat in the front and ring the bell when they came in the door to, so they could get their table. The restaurant sits empty on this day and will continue as such at least until Friday because the beloved owner, Lino, passed away Sunday at the age of 84. He was not only a successful businessman in this community, but the apple of his children's eyes. Everybody knew him and uh, loved him and um, I'm proud to call him my dad. And even though the kitchen will be quiet this week, Lino Milano's memory will forever be a staple at Milano's restaurant in Westlaco. We are going on the fourth generation soon of the restaurant business and we'll continue to thrive and live in his memory and, and carry on what he started.